In this platform highlight, we'll be looking at our newest view within the service management tool, the Kanban board. The easiest way to create a Kanban board is by first opening a list view of the template you would like to include within the board. For this example, let's use Open Incidents. Any service management tool user can create their own Kanban board by simply selecting the new Kanban board button from the top right hand corner. After this, you select which attribute you would like the lanes to be based on, the ID, and what you want as the description. Next, you simply select which lane values you would like to add. and you can easily delete them by clicking the trash can icon to the right. Within the Effect A Kanban board, you can also add labels. For this example, let's add contact type as the label. Next, you can modify the colors of the table by choosing the palette you'd like to use. As with all of Effect A's graphic boards, you can modify the order of these colors simply by dragging and dropping them into the order that you would like. Next, you can choose which information you would like included in the Assign To field. Let's use Support Person. Finally, you can include the deadline or some sort of date which is included within the data card. For this example, let's use the date that it was last updated. Once you have the board exactly as you like it, you simply click Save. If you're an admin or have the rights, you're able to save this board into any role included within the service management tool. However, if you're just a normal user, you can only save it as your own personal view. Once you make the selection of where you want the board saved, you simply enter the name of the board and click Save. If you would like to change the template used for the Kanban board, you simply click the Settings tab and make your changes here. If you'd like to also include hidden or both hidden and visible cards, you can also make this modification from the Settings tab. Finally, you can choose to filter cards off of a single attribute or multiple attributes depending on your needs. Filtering cards won't reorder the cards within the Kanban board, it simply hides cards that don't meet the conditions. For this example, let's use the contact type as set to phone call. As you can see, all of the cards that were not created through a phone call have now been taken away from the board. To remove this condition, you simply click the X and click apply, and all of the cards are brought back to their correct locations. With Effect Ace Kanban board, you can also add lane limitations by simply clicking the number at the top of the column next to the title and entering the maximum number of cards that should be in that column. If a user tries to move a card within a lane which is at its limit, they will receive a notification that this would exceed the limit and the card will automatically be sent back to its original location. If a user would like to edit a data card, they simply click the pencil icon at the top right hand corner of any of the cards and they will instantly open that card in edit mode to make it even easier. To move or reorder cards, the user simply drags the card to the appropriate column or to the appropriate location within the column. Finally, thanks to our Kanban board being built within our service management tool, all of your workflow automations will work seamlessly with our Kanban board, making it a more powerful tool than most other simple post-it note style digital Kanban boards. This can be as simple as setting a data card to hidden when it's moved to the closed status, or more complicated, such as complex approval chains, requiring certain information, or even sending notifications when a certain action is taken. We hope this highlight gave you a brief look into the Kanban board included within our platform. If you'd like to learn more, have a look at one of our other highlight videos. If you have any questions or would like to try our platform out for yourself, please send us a message or request a demo. We hope to hear from you.